What's up guys? Uh, today I am at my local disc replay and it is Blu-ray day. So basically what I do is I give myself a cap of $30 and I say, what for $30 can I find in here? If I can find a bunch of stuff that's cheap, well, then I'll get a lot of stuff. If I find something rare that costs the majority of that budget or more, because sometimes I'm allowed to go over it if I find something awesome. Basically, I put a limit on myself so that I don't come out of here spending like $90 because that has happened. It's not impossible, but it has happened. And so 30 is like a good cap for me. Anyway, I'm going to go in there right now and I'm going to see what I find. And then I'll let you guys know. So to be continued, for me, it's like 30 minutes. For you guys, it'll be instant, obviously, because this is filmed and put on YouTube. All right, guys. Uh, so I just got out of disc replay. I don't like the way this camera is placed. It is what it is. We're going to get through this and we're going to put the first blu-ray trip video down okay so i told you guys previously uh that my goal is 30 dollars. i went over it by 10 and I'm, I'm i'm i wish i hadn't but i understand why i did and soon you will too okay so first of all cool thing about discreet play is uh they have a buy five get the sixth one free so i got one of these bad boys for free okay let's start at the top we have event horizon now i'm gonna admit i have never seen event horizon but i have heard awesome things and it's a movie about space with Lawrence fishburne so why wouldn't i want to check it out okay next up i have a movie one of the few uh from uh this director that has eluded me and that is pulp fiction that's right i got pulp fiction which i'm excited about i love this movie and i've never owned it on blu-ray it's exciting to have it next up guys is a movie i have not seen i have heard nothing but critical acclaim for and that is whiplash now critical acclaim doesn't amount for a lot in my opinion but i have heard great things from friends too that whiplash is an awesome movie and if nothing else it has jk simmons in it and miles teller so it's got to have great acting all right, next up, guys, we have the movie Donnie Darko. I have never seen it, but it has Jake Gyllenhaal. And since it has Jake Gyllenhaal, I feel like it can't be all bad. So I picked it up. Then, guys, I picked up Bram Stoker's Dracula. Now, it was either this or Carrie from 2009, which is my favorite Carrie movie. I know that's not right to say, but I did pick up Dracula. Um, I don't feel bad that I chose this. I have not seen this. A lot of these movies I haven't seen yet. And I'm just buying them for the first time. So I'm going to watch them soon. A lot of these have a, a darker tone to them. So with October coming up, it's a good time to watch those. And the final one, guys, is Point Break. Point Break is a movie that I've wanted on Blu-ray forever and a day. And I have not been able to find it. I finally got a chance to find it, which is exciting. It's not a rip-off cover because this disc replay had like a printed cover version of it. I hate those. This is an actual cover. I was excited about it. Now that I found it, I'm sure that they will come out with a 4K version or I'll find a 4K version for super cheap. It's just how it works. It's not right. Okay, guys, but the reason I went over my budget was because I found the steelbook of King Kong and it reminds me of my Doom steelbook cover. I, I had to have it. It was $10, so I went $10 over my budget. I wish I hadn't, but at the same time, I understand why I did, because King Kong on Blu-ray in a steel book cover it just looks cool. And guys, that's my Blu-ray haul from today. It is hot in this car, and I need the AC on stat. So I'm going to stop this video, but I am going to say, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to share this video with your friends, make sure you do that by hitting the share button. And if you have any of these movies on your shelf, let's talk about them. It's an exciting thing to do. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.